Hey guys, welcome to my channel. So today is a really fun video. I'm doing a super bright rainbow look, as you can see. And it is with Peachy Queen Cosmetics Tropical Bay Palette. Now, I was sent this in PR. Amy, the owner of Peachy Queen, actually sent me a ton of palettes to take some photos for her for her website. So this was one of them. And she did send me two, so I think I might have a giveaway with the extra ones that she sent me. She sent me three extras, so I think I might have a giveaway. Keep an eye out for that. But let's go ahead and get into this palette. This is $29.99 on Peachy Queen's website. I know her palettes do frequently go on sale a lot, so if you keep an eye out for sales, then you could probably get this cheaper. But for the most part, it's it's roughly $30, and it is a beautiful rainbow palette. This yellow, oof, this yellow is just everything. I'm wearing this yellow base all around, just all around. It's such a really beautiful, vibrant yellow. I absolutely love it. So I will swatch a few of these for you guys. Let me go ahead and first show you some product shots that I took for her. I did swatches and then I also did a regular photo shoot of the palette. So here's those. And these don't have shade names, but I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and swatch the yellow, this kind of fuchsia pink, her red, and the sparkly purple uh, in the palette. So let me get those ready for you guys. So there is this purple, it is a more deeper purple and it is a shimmer. And then this blue, did I say I was gonna swatch a blue? I don't think I did, but well, I guess we're swatching a blue now. And then I'm gonna swatch this red, and I think I said this fuchsia, right? I can't remember what I said. Okay, so here is that beautiful shimmer purple worst swatches at wow hold on that wasn't even on what that's like half on my hand i'm there we go much better <laughs> okay so this one is that blue oh my lord that is so pretty Did, whoops oh look i just barely touched it this is red and then here is that fuchsia so here is, you know, four of the colors, so you can see they're pretty vibrant. I actually want to show you guys what her shadows look like on top of a white primer, because white, I did, I did all of these on my actual lid with a white primer. So let me show you some of the swatches with a white primer. I used the P. Louise in the shade, I think this is zero, the shade zero, it's just a pure white. So let me put this white on so you guys can see how bright her rainbow shades are with them. So this one is a white base, and let me just show you some of the colors. I am gonna go in with this yellow here. This yellow is amazing. I think I'm also gonna go in with green, and let's do, this is like a really pretty misty purple, and let's go in with her purple. So there's yellow. Let's build it up with one more. Beautiful. Here's green. Oh my, <gasps> that is so beautiful. Let's build that up with one more. Let me start it up here. Ooh, it's so pretty. This is a shimmer, it's that purple, light, like silvery, kind of lavender. All right, there's two coats of that. So you guys, oh man. So you guys can see how much brighter they are on top of a white base. But anyways, you guys, if you guys wanna see the look I created, this is just gonna be a really quick, fast video, then just keep watching. And oh yes, just a heads up, my blending with, <laughs> My blending with orange and purple are brown. Sorry, you're gonna have to deal with terrible blending for this video because I can't get purple and orange to blend together 
ever, ever. So it, it does look a little brown when I'm blending and I apologize for that. So uh, uh, feel free to judge me. Leave all the hate comments down below. <laughs> Let's go over what I use for the rest of my makeup look. So for this inner corner here and the brow bone, I went in with the Huda Beauty Neon Palette, and this is the orange palette. And I went in with this shade right here, this gold shade, which is very beautiful. I went in with DJ Glam Lashes in the style Berta, and they are smaller on the inner corner and longer on the outer corners so they really help lift my hooded eyes up. For blush and highlight, I went in with Natasha Denona Bloom palette, and I went in with this dark blush shade here and this kind of orangey peach toned highlighter. I wanted to give myself like that sunburn kind of look, so I think I did pretty good. And for lips, I went in with Fenty Beauty, and this is unattached, and this is just the most prettiest, that's not, real English <laughs> coral color and I've always loved Fenty's formula. It's super comfortable to wear. It lasts forever. It doesn't crack. It's matte but it's like malleable. It, it doesn't feel tight on your lips and it doesn't like suck them dry so I love their formula. Alright you guys that is all I have for the Tropical Babe palette from Peachy Queen Cosmetics. Thank you so much again, Amy, for sending this to me. If you guys like this video, let me know, and I'll see you in my next one. Bye! Okay, so let's go over what I went up. All right, let's go over what I, what? Okay, if you guys like this,